Hey everyone, my name is Hassan and I will be demonstrating the developmental network using the Spongebob characters. A developmental network is a chain of interactions amongst gene activators and inhibitors that can result in specific outcomes. Now, Plankton's main goal in life is to steal the Krabby Patty formula from the Krusty Krab. His wife Karen attempts to help him do so. Spongebob and Mr. Krabs and Squidward must stop Karen and Plankton from stealing the Krabby Patty formula. So in our network, our pathway shows that Squidward activates or stimulates transcription of Spongebob. The Spongebob gene represses the Karen gene. The Karen gene product inhibits Mr. Krabs, and Mr. Krabs gene represses Plankton, thus defeating him. So in other words, when Mr. Krab is transcribed, Plankton is defeated and the Krabby Patty formula is Let's take a look at what would happen if we were to modify our pathway. So our first example, if we have a mutant that is lacking Squidward, Spongebob would not be activated, which will allow Karen to stop Mr. Krabs and Plankton will not be defeated. In mutants lacking Mr. Krabs, Plankton would not be inhibited and therefore is not defeated and steals the formula. Double mutants lacking Spongebob and Karen, Mr. Krabs is able to stop Plankton because Karen is not there to stop Mr. Krabs and Mr. Krabs is therefore able to stop Plankton. Double mutants lacking Karen and Mr. Krabs, Mr. Krabs is not there to stop Plankton and therefore transcription of Plankton does occur and the formula is stolen.